Hey, this is Nick from Jenga FX, and today I'm going to be showing you a breakdown of this really cool lightning spell. This effect uses mesh flipbooks to cycle through various lightning strikes, and Illusion makes this sort of mesh-based animation extremely easy to create. I want to note that all vegetation and environment textures in this video were also made with Illusion. So to make the primary lightning strike mesh, we're going to encode 8 different strike frames into our single lightning strike mesh. Frames will be created by animating various parameters such as transforms, scale, and noise distributions. These frames can then be played back in engine because we're going to encode the animation data into the mesh's vertex color alpha channel. This is just a checkbox option in the geo accumulation node. Inside the Unreal Engine material for our lightning strike, we're going to use an if statement that compares the mesh's vertex color alpha channel to our particle color alpha value. You can see that whenever I animate the test frame parameter, different lightning strike meshes light up, and because this is a mass material, the rest of the frames are not going to show up. As you can see here, if you animate this fast enough, you get some awesome primary lightning strikes. Next up, we're going to use Illusion to create a tiling smoke beam texture. And you can see the final results of that here. This gives us a nice wispy smoke that follows the lightning strike. Then we're going to create a glow texture that's used for decals on the ground, as well as glowing sprites at the base of the strike. We went ahead and created a distortion normal map that we'll use later as well. And here, you can see at the bottom of the lightning strike, we have a really nice glow sprite. The next animated mesh flipbook we're going to create is for an electric impact animation. This mesh will be used to help ground the strike and show that it really is quite powerful. We're going to animate a torus and displace it with noise over time. We then accumulate the frames and encode the vertex alpha like we did for the previous strike. You can see the result of the impact mesh animation here. Because the vertices are so chaotic, it really adds to the punchiness of this effect. In real life, before a strike occurs, a lightning leader tries to find the path of least resistance before the primary strike connects to the ground. We use this texture and spawn it sparingly at random intervals, as you can see here at the top of the strike. Previously, we created a distortion texture for our impact shockwave. The same grayscale texture we generated the normal map with is used as an alpha input for the distortion's lerp. We are able to control the distortion intensity over time with the particle's alpha color. You can see here that this is pretty punchy. Next up, we have a simple decal material that we're going to use as a glowing hotspot on the ground where the primary bolt strikes. This uses the same glow texture that we created earlier. In my previous video where I broke down a fire anomaly, we created this spark texture with Illusion. I'm reusing that resource here for a lot of impact sparks. We have one emitter that emits the orange sparks, and then we have another emitter that emits more magical blue sparks. I also created this rock mesh in my last video, and we use it as debris to further enhance how powerful this spell really is. I'm not sure how to stop rock debris from spinning after they've stopped moving, so if anyone knows, tell me down in the comments how to actually do it with Niagara. Finally, this smoke texture was created from my previous anomaly and we're reusing it to give us some final shape definition and color variation for the impact. Now let's see the final effect in action again. You can see that Illusion really is a powerful asset creation tool in your visual effects and environment art arsenal. This project that we're working on is a small vertical slice of what could be a real game in production, and we're using it as a testing grounds to ensure that Illusion is a production-ready powerhouse. If you like this video, let me know down in the comments what you think about it, and I'll see you in the next breakdown video.